Despite losing in the finals of the Accenture Match Play Championship on Sunday, Martin Keimer has risen to number one on the official World Golf Ranking for the first time in his career. He becomes the second youngest player ever to reach that mark and the 14th player ever since the inception of the ranking in 1986. All of which begs the next question, can he stay there? Well, yes and no. That's because this week, many of the world's top players will play the Honda Classic and just as easily as Keimer passed Lee Westwood, well, he can get passed just as well. There are a lot of very good players up near the top of the ranking and unlike when Tiger Woods had a big lead for so many years, well, this thing's going to be very volatile for a very long time. So while I believe in Keimer, while I think he's a terrific player, and I do believe that he's the best player in the world right now, that doesn't necessarily mean that he's going to retain that number one ranking for a very long time. We have a lot of very good players. Lee Westwood, as I mentioned, Graham McDowell, the new number three, Luke Donald, and don't forget about, yes, even Tiger Woods and Phil Mickelson right behind those four guys, the four Europeans. So it's really a wide open race for anybody. Martin Keimer could remain there for a very long time, or he could be knocked off next week. For ESPN.com, I'm Jason Sobel.